So Jocelyn, congratulations on playing in the sophomore showcase game this year. What were your thoughts coming into the game? Thank you. Um, coming into the game, I was a little nerve-wracking just because I wasn't familiar with any of the teammates, but um, just throwing yourself into it, honestly, we collaborated really well and we were able to just work together without even like knowing each other. So I think that's a really cool thing about soccer, like you can just bond over one sport and be able to make it work together. After playing in the game today, what would be something you wish you would have prepared for in advance? Um, I think, I definitely think I could have been a little bit more controlled. I think I was a bit rushed, but that might have been because of the pressure. Um, I definitely need to work on just relaxing the ball and like slowing it down and resetting. Um, but yeah, and I also probably could have been in better shape. I think I always could have been in better shape. So last question for you, how do you think you played today in relationship to everybody that was out there from the other schools? I think I played okay. I definitely think I was a little more affected by the pressure than everybody else, but maybe I was just in my own head. Um, but also I think that it also contributed that a lot of people like knew some people on their team. So just like being by ourselves, I think we did pretty well for just not knowing a single person. What are your future plans? What do you hope to get accomplished from this event? Um, I hope to choose a school that I'd like to go to. Um, I'd like to continue playing soccer and I'd like to study criminal justice as well. Um, so hopefully a coach that can help me accomplish both. Jocelyn, you did a great job today. It's been fun coaching you the last two years and uh, we wish you the best. Thank you. So Jacob, you just got to finish the uh, ACCAC sophomore showcase game. Uh, what were your thoughts? Um, well, it was good to play at such a higher level. Um, it's nice to see what it's like around other teams and what they're capable of. And just honestly, even though we weren't able to train together or anything like that, it, for a little bit, it felt like we were a team and it was nice to see how, how it was. What is something that you, uh, looking back, wish you would have prepared for better for today's game? Uh, checking my calendar, stuff like that, as well as you know maybe getting to know the opposition a little more. I did actually do a little bit of uh, research on the players I was looking at. Uh, that I feel like that's more of my main game, but I just feel maybe conditioning and stuff like that would have also been good as well. Well, I want to thank you for two years at Gateway. Um, what is something that you would tell, uh, you know, future geckos coming in uh, that you look back on now and, and kind of wish you had done more of or, you know, things that you're, you're grateful for with the program? This is going to sound harsh. Shut up, do what you're told, do what's right. So many players don't do what they're supposed to. They don't eat right. They don't train. They show up to. They don't show up to practice on time. They don't do their grade checks. They don't do their homework or anything. If you sit at the front of class and you're cooperating with your teacher and you're talking and you're getting involved, you'll at the very least get a C. And unfortunately, it's sad to see a lot of players who could be a lot more and they're not. But they give other players like myself the opportunity where I may not be the most talented, but I will work hard on the field and off the field. Jacob, what are you looking forward to accomplishing and kind of parlaying this game into for the future? Um, well, I'm trying to get myself out there. Uh, you know, I have film. I have, I have the desire to go to a four-year institution where I can play and study more. So I'm just hoping really to find my home, if anything, and just get a career more than anything. I want to be a coach or some sort of athletic trainer for full time. So, you know, if I find something where it's a good middle ground that I can afford and I can play at the very least and I can, I can, you know, succeed or do things to succeed in my career in school, that would be fantastic. Jacob, I want to thank you for two years at Gateway. Uh, you always show up, do your best. I appreciate it. And I wish you the best in your future. Thank you. Appreciate it. Well, Joe, good job today in the game. Um, what were your thoughts coming in? Like, what were your expectations? Definitely thinking about the higher intensity of the, the game today. Um, was hoping that we had a little bit more skill for players on there so I could acknowledge and possibly get to play with some of them today. What happened during the game that you were expecting and what happened that you perhaps uh, got caught off guard with? I was definitely expecting more shots on goal. I was definitely expecting a little bit more corner shots, uh, more diving. Um, me coming out, I really had more confidence this game. Um, I felt like my team players, definitely the new ones that I didn't know, helped me and boosted me a lot more to where I felt really good about the team overall. 
In preparing for the sophomore showcase, is there anything you look back on and wish that if you could tell uh, future players they should prepare for for the game? Definitely train. Train as hard as you can and train as much as you can. Get those extra touches in as much as you can. Uh, people here definitely expect a, a lot of you and I hope that they too can understand that this is a big opportunity for them and just prepare as much as you can. Uh, and looking to the future, what would you like to accomplish? What's something maybe from this game? You know, we were just discussing it that you were the only goalkeeper. Um, so the odds of coaches reaching out are going to be really good. But what, what did you hope to get done today? And, and what are you looking for in the future? Definitely to show my skill that I have as a goalkeeper. I feel like uh, today I didn't get to show as much of it because of the solid team that I had on both sides. Uh, I do want to see more of a pressured team this next coming season and I want to show everybody what I am capable of. Most likely uh, going to start training a little bit more on core strengthening and possibly just finishing my career in associate or my bachelor's degree. Awesome. Well, Joe, thanks for the past year that you spent with us at Gateway um, and we wish you the best. Thank you and thank you all the coaches. You're still here? It's over. Go home. Go.